Oh, uh, sorry, Joshua Bugs here. Um, this is a short, um, short, uh, and what? Senua, Hellblade, Senua, Senua Sacrifice thing? Yeah. Um, yeah. I'm just re-exploring an area that I, I, I didn't re-explore the first time around. Um, I find this whole thing much more interesting. They, they, they focus on the mirror more and stuff like that. It almost seems like maybe you are supposed to do this level first before um, the fire guy. Um, I'm planning on alternating between uh, the combat difficulties, between auto and hard, and figure out which is harder. But I think auto is probably harder. Because I, I had a really easy time just now. Oh, I don't think I found this one before. I had a really easy time beating, um... Beating... Who was it? The Northmen say that Odin is always in search of knowledge and wisdom and magic. There was a very wise being named Mimir, who guarded the waters of wisdom which flew from the roots of the world tree. Odin wished to drink from this spring, but he had to pay a price. So he gouged out his own eye as offering to Mimir. He drank from the well and traded one way of seeing for another. So, what was I saying? Um, I just think that it's, um, it's, uh, probably the difficulty, if I'm not, if I'm not mistaken, uh, my fight with, um, Valraven was so easy on hard mode that I suspect that automatic mode is potentially harder than hard because I think it, it figures out how much of a challenge it should give you and so in my case um, I'm having such an easy time with the combat that it's better to do automatic mode and then they, they figure out oh um, hard is too easy for you we gotta send more guys at you we gotta make the guys stronger we have to make them last longer and yeah I think that's that's what's been happening And, um, yeah, so I'm going to try automatic mode again, and I bet I'm going to have more of a challenge. And now I'll switch it back to hard, and see if, um, see if I find it easier, which I suspect I will. And then, from then on, I guess we can keep it all automatic until we should reach the end. And when we reach the end, I I'm afraid I'm going to have to switch it back down to easy mode, because I don't want to, I don't want to falter in the final part, and, uh, have it end the game on me like last time. I think the final part, it sort of like forces Senua to make her sacrifice if you fall even one time. What, did I fall more than once? I can't remember. But I was, I was horrified when I finally went down and um, and <laughs> uh, and it was over. And um, you know, I wound up uh, crying <laughs> at the ending. <laughs> Um, I think, you know, uh, even though it wasn't that bad an ending, but, uh, I just, I just really felt like I had, uh, let Senua down, and I would have liked to have done better by her. So I think I can't use these magic doorways anymore. See, if this magic doorway was open, I'd be able to walk, oh, I can, there it goes. Pretty cool.
Send all that. I'm not sure if I'll have a fight tonight, uh, though. So it, it might be a question of figuring that out for later. But I just thought I'd mention that. I'm not like going straight forward right away. I'm sort of examining everything first. Look at that, I can destroy the wall again that way, but that's not as good. There's no reason to do that at this point. We want to keep the wall up for now. I'll just run along a little bit. Man, it's beautiful here. Whoa, oops. If I fall down there, would I get impaled on the spikes? I don't I don't want to find out. <laughs> I can't afford to let the blackness crawl up any the center of his arm any more than it already has. If I can avoid it. found this one already. Let's listen to it again, shall we? This time I'll do it while I walk around and won't I won't just stand there next to it. Well no, I should stand there and watch it. Because um I wanna hear the um I wanna hear the actual voices of the game intensely here. Sacrifice in order to receive well, as I move. They tell how the runes were revealed to Odin only in sacrifice. He hung himself from the world tree, and he stabbed himself with a spear, and he dedicated the sacrifice to himself. Wow. For nine nights he hung on the tree without food or drink, and at last he saw the runes below him. He gave a cry and gathered them in his mind and learnt them. Then he fell from the tree. What a crazy motherfucker. Am I right? What if I had to jump down from here? Probably not. And rehang all the crows this way. Let's rehang the crows, they look pretty. I like them like that red. Bright red in the sunshine with the green. Kind of clashing colors, but it works. Very noble, very regal, I think. It's Christmas colors, I guess, red and green. Hello there, Val Robin. I beat you. Didn't I? Easily. A hard mode. Uh, first time around it was a lot harder. That was an automatic mode, but I mean, I, I've become like kind of a professional since then. So I think that might be. I can't tell. I can't tell if it's actually easier on hard mode or if um if it's just that I got better. 
you know? You get me. Is this where I came up from? I think so. No, wait, that's where I came up from. Is it? No. No, no, no. That's where I came up. I don't know. I'm lost now. Did I just... Did I just close the... Oops, I accidentally closed the door. I closed off the bridge for myself. That must be where I came up from. that way and across the bridge. So that's where I came up from. So I could I could just uh, walk across here. Sort of searching out all the nooks and crannies. I heard something to my right there. That was really creepy. Whoa! Man, that creeped me out. I don't know what to make of that. Bring back all the current side. jump down these parts to have a rope. Kinda odd. It's like the rope the rope tells me that I can jump down. But I can't cross that way. I can go around this way. Doesn't necessarily mean I can jump down. Go ahead. 
Oh, it won't let me cross here anymore. I think originally I could cross here if I wanted. But now it's like, uh... Now it's just like an illusion. Not, not a purposeful illusion, but a glitch in the game. Oh well. Jump down and stuff. That really creeps me out. Okay, that doesn't change. Well, that, that 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 adds the beam, but I can't cross the beam anymore. Darn it. Yeah, and then let me cross the beam if it would be in this area. What if I made the beam invisible? Then would I be able to cross it? Let's, let's just test that out. Oh no, I'm stuck? Oh, I'm not stuck. Let's, um, let's make the beam invisible. Now there's no more beam. Cross it now. Uh, nope, that doesn't help. <laughs> yeah, it definitely doesn't help at all. Huh. All right, well let's just go. I guess I don't really need the beam anymore anyway. So that's pretty much everything. Nothing going on here. It's just a long walk around for nothing, I guess. But I really wanted to see if there was anything new. For some reason I suspect I may have missed something. Some of these sounds. It's like something, something I'm missing. I always feel like there's something I'm missing when I'm playing this game. And it's in the best sort of way. Here's our final fight with Valraven. Should I climb back up around there? See if there's anything new? Maybe I should. This should be a very slow episode, just not much going on, just traveling around, having a look at everything. Isn't there one of, um, yeah, one of Drift's one of Drift's uh, messages up there. Oh no, it's not a message. It's just it's just one of those portals. Yeah, we like it like this, so we can climb along the tree. Yeah, because the first time that you go up there onto the tree, it forces you down. So, what's up there if we just go up there again when there's no cinema and no obligatory fight with Valraven? We could go up to the nest again and have a look. Might be interesting. Probably nothing. But, let's see. Just in case. No, you can't go back up there again. They, they drop some rocks on it, and Senua doesn't like to take walk over rocks. She's like, rocks? Screw that. And I don't disagree. Who does like to walk on top of rocks? Nobody. That's who. So I guess that's it. We can't go back up that way. It's a shame. 
Yeah, nothing, nothing there. We'll move forward. Now. Okay. Well, obviously we can go this way now. Well, let's just go this way first. Ooh, I gotta save. Um, since it saves here, let's stop here. This is as good a place as any. And next time we'll just explore around here a little more. And I think there's nothing here, but I really want to seek out all the corners. Like I said, is that okay with you, Sanoa? She is being quiet. Well, see you next time. Joshy Bragg's out. Uh, save the equipment.